Hey everyone, Justin Odisho here. Will video editing be replaced by artificial intelligence? This is a concern that a lot of people bring up in many different fields. Artificial intelligence is gonna take cashier jobs, clerk jobs, whatever. And how does this have implications for the video world? So I think that there are many apps now that you'll see that'll automatically cut your video together, automatically sync to the beat. And so what I think is gonna happen is that the majority of trivial tasks or a lot of trivial tasks are going to be helped out by automation, um, especially hopefully things like rotoscoping, masking. Uh, you already see new tools coming out like Adobe Sensei, and I'm sure there's other programs aside from Adobe, but you're already seeing better tools for stabilization um, better tools for cropping and reframing, um, new roto brush advancements. And so hopefully artificial intelligence tools and technology just continue to make those type of things better, like face detection, selection, um, syncing to the beat and cutting. But the other, on the other end of the spectrum, will you as a video editor or the job or role of a video editor ever completely get replaced. I don't think quite yet that that will get completely completely replaced. So if we're gonna talk about social media type of videos, um, making like a random little slideshow, obviously that's already there. Like your camera photos app can put together a slideshow. We don't need a human to do that. However, if we're gonna talk about a more of like a craftsman type of telling a story uh editing and knowing exactly where to cut exactly what emphasis knowing what is funny in a video or not like humor suspense all of these human emotions i do think that there is still for the time being and foreseeable future not going to be a full replacement of someone a human editor putting something together like that by hand um there just isn't, I think, there just, that is just a human touch that I think a artificial intelligence won't be able to do quite yet or in the, or in the near future. Um, so I think we're going to get a lot of, ultimately, I think it's going to be, I think it's going to help. It's going to cut out, hopefully, a lot of trivial work, a lot of trivial tasks so that you don't have to know how to use a bunch of software if you just want to put together like simple home home videos or slideshows or even text and graphics all of that stuff will hopefully become more automated but ultimately there is still going to be a need for that artisan that craftsman who knows what music to pick puts what where cuts things at the exact right moment and tells a complete story with the video um, the same way artificial intelligence can come up with random stories and books and jokes, but, you know, there's just not quite human yet. So let me know what you guys think. Obviously, I still should do more research about this. I'm just kind of talking about from what I've seen. Um, let me know what you guys think. I know a lot of people are, are fear that artificial intelligence is just going to leave everyone with nothing to do, but I I don't quite lean that way, but I have a couple books on my shelf on the subject that I should delve into a bit more. So let me know what you guys think in the comments if you've thought about this or how you've seen it progressing from the days of physical and analog all the way till now and where you see it going in the future. That's my opinion. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, check out some more. I mean, I'm experimenting with these raw videos, so hopefully you enjoy. Thank you so much. <laughs> Obviously, I don't know how to end a video, and I'll see you in the next one. <laughs>